Jordan elimination method. What is Gauss Jordan elimination method? Consider the system of equation AX is equal to B. Consider the system of equation AX is equal to B. The method of obtaining the solution of the system of equation by reducing the matrix A to a diagonal matrix okay, is known as Gauss Jordan elimination method. In this method, we convert matrix A to a diagonal matrix and then find the solution of the system of equation. Okay. Question is by using Gauss Jordan elimination method, solve the following system of equations 2x minus y plus 3z is equal to 9, x plus y plus z is equal to 6, x minus y plus z is equal to 2. Okay. First we express the system of equation into ax is equal to b form. Here a equal to a equal to matrix coefficient of the variables. That is here the coefficient of x is 2, y is minus 1, z is 3. Okay. Next in this equation the coefficient of x is 1, y is 1, z is 1. Here we can write the coefficient of x is 1, y is minus 1. Z is 1. Okay. Then X is equal to the variables are X, Y, Z. Okay. B is equal to we can write here the constants are 9, 6, 2. 9, 6, 2. Okay. Next we write the augmented matrix. That is equal to matrix. Here A is 2, minus 1, 3, 1, 1, 1. 1 minus 1, 1. Insert B here. That is 9, 6, 2. This is the augmented matrix. Convert this matrix to a diagonal matrix. Convert this matrix to a diagonal matrix using row eclan form. Okay. We interchange R1 and R2 for making A11 position as 1. For that we interchange it as 1, 1, 1. 6, then 2, minus 1, 3, 9, 1, minus 1, 1, 2. Okay. Here we interchange R1 and R2 for making A11 position as 1. Okay. A11 position as 1. To convert 2 as 0 using the transformation R2 tends to R2 minus 2 R1. We get here R2 minus 2 R1 is 2 minus 2 that is 0. Negative 1 minus 2 we get negative 3. Then 3 minus 2 we get 1. 9 minus 12. Next we convert this 1 to 0 using the transformation R3 tends to R3 minus R1. We get here R3 is 1. 1 minus 1 we get 0. Negative 1 minus 1 that is negative 2. Here 1 minus 1 we get 0. 2 minus 6 we get minus 4. Okay. Next we consider the second row. Consider the first non-zero element. Here the first non-zero element is minus 3. Okay. Convert it into 1. Using the transformation R2 tends to R2 divided by negative 3. We get here 0, 1. Next is negative 1 by 3. Negative 3 by negative 3 here is 1. Okay. 0 minus 2. 0 minus 4. Okay. Next we convert minus 2, 1 to be 0. Okay. Using the transform. First one is R1 tends to R1 minus R2. Then we can write here R1 minus R2 is 1 minus 0. We get 1. 1 minus 1 we get 0. 1 minus minus 3 that is 1 plus 1 by 3. Next is 6 minus 1 we get 5. Okay. Then we write the second row that is 0, 1, negative 1 by 3, 1. Okay. Next converting minus 2 to be 0 using the transformation R3 tends to R3 plus 2 R2. Here we get here is 0 plus 2 R2. That is 0. Okay. 
Next is negative 2 plus 2. We get 0. Next we get 0 plus 2 into negative 1 by 3. That is negative 2 by 3. Next is, next is negative 4 plus 2R2. That is 2 into 1. We get negative 2. That is here is negative 2. Next consider the third row. Here the first non-zero element is negative 2 by 3. Convert it into 1. Okay. We use the transformation R3 tends to minus 3 by 2 R3. We get here 0, 0, 1, 3. Here we have to convert this matrix to be diagonal matrix. For that we convert 4 by 3, negative 1 by 3 to be 0. Okay. First we convert 4 by 3 as to be 0. Using the transformation R1 tends to R1 minus 4 by 3 R3. 1 minus 4 by 3 into 0 that is 1. Next is 0 minus 4 by 3 into 0. We get 0. Next is 4 by 3 minus 4 by 3 into 1. We get 0. Next we write 5 minus 4 by 3 into 3. We get 5 minus 4 that is 1. Okay. Next we convert negative 1 by 3 to be 0. Using the transformation R2 tends to R2 plus R3 by 3. Using this transformation we get 0, 1, 0, 2. Okay. Next write the third row. That is 0, 0, 1, 3. Okay. Now it converted into a diagonal matrix. Okay. Here the diagonal elements 1, 1, 1. Okay. Rank of the augmented matrix equal to number of non-zero rows. Here number of non-zero rows is 1, 2, 3. Okay. Rank of augmented matrix is 3. Here the transformed A is 1, 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1. Okay. Then rank of A equal to number of non-zero rows. Here rank of the augmented matrix is equal to rank A. Then we say that the given system of equation is consistent. Okay. Therefore the given system is consistent. Here the number of unknowns is equal to 3. That is n is equal to 3. Also rank is equal to 3. That is r is equal to 3. Here n is equal to r. Okay. Number of unknowns is equal to rank. Then we say that the system has a unique solution. Therefore the system has a unique solution. Next we have to find the solution of the given system. Okay. Next consider the equation Ax is equal to B. Write here the transformed A and here transformed B. That is here. Here transformed A is 1 0 0 0 1 0 0 0 1. That is 1 0 0 0 1 0 0 0 1. Okay. Next X is X Y Z. X Y Z. Okay. That is equal to B here is. 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. Next we make the equation. 1 into x we get x is equal to here 1. Okay. Next y equal to 2. y equal to 2. Next is z is equal to 3. Okay. Therefore the solution is x is equal to 1, y is equal to 2, z is equal to 3. Clear.